Hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen to one more episode on the escapist on Iron Gate on day 19 you know normally I don't like to hold on to promises and I told people on I'm not sure if it was the latest or the one before episode I told people that I would escape around day 20 now here's one thing I think I am very close of doing that what the frack what a good way to start an episode getting taste some more and more hair out of my butt but hey at least I got into the infirmary which is close to my desk where I need to take all my illegal stuff out of it before that cell toss my name is the sparrow Jenny welcome ladies and gentlemen when we last left off we had a very very stressful time I must say so when we went to the roof and I got you know the last bit of items I needed to you know to accomplish one of the items in my list one of the objectives which was exploring a little bit more of the roof and I didn't save the game so it's always a stressful time and I'm so happy I'm so glad that we made it through I dodged all the spotlights all the guards even my bad skill at this game even that I was able to avoid and now what I'm down to do is wait there's not much else I can do without more info what I want to do as I've told you in the last episode I think I want to keep a low profile not do anything much wrong I don't even have any favors, so I think I'm not gonna even bother to accept any what I want to do is get on the main part of the building where the spotlight is at I want to avoid the spotlight obviously and I want to get to the left part of the prison we're always talking about the roof by the way I want to cut the the fence that is out there with the cutters I have the study ones and explore that zipline hook and see where does it take me not sure if it takes me outside or not oh a sheet of metal that will cover my shortage of sheets of metal which I actually have you know I have so much stuff in this prison layout that I wish I could just borrow to the next season <laughs> Because I have just have so many files that I'm not gonna use. I'm gonna leave them here. Here's another stupid super glue. Let's take now the tolls, the rolls of toilet paper. I was gonna say tolls of toilet paper. That's what I'm gonna call it from now on. Tolls of toilet paper. Toilet paper. Is that even a thing? Let's take them. Let's check if we need this crafting note. No, we don't. So let's give it to unforgiving czar. You're gonna, you're unforgiving, but I hope you forgive me by me giving you that page let's make this happen paper mache and another one there we go that makes the fake vent cover one more thing we need to bring to the vent system and also this sheet of metal let's check what these guys are selling for the sake of you know checking I have $100 but um, I guess I'm just gonna save this money in case I need to buy something after doing my research up the roof this night this is one of those times and because it is one of those times I recognize we are near the end that has a good side in it and a bad side it in it the bad side is this season is almost done with slap it in the face slap slap it in the face I can't keep saying this because every time I do the season I'm on lasts for 30 more episodes. Look at San Pancho and what happened. God dang it, Sparrow. You're ruining your life. Stop doing that. It's one of those times where I don't think I need anything. I don't even know what I'm looking for. I'm not completing any more favors. I'm not. I could even ditch my job. I don't think I need this huge amount of money. There we go. And I'm just waiting for the night time because the night time is now the time where I can make stuff happen. I think I need one more dental floss for the cutting floss. Let's get to the exercise period, keep the low profile, and let's make this cutting floss happen. Like so. There we go. One more item we can bring up there and it can be useful. Maybe. Maybe yes, maybe no. Dr. F, take this page. I don't need it and I cannot go with it through the metal detector because there must be metal parts into this special paper a file tube of talcum powder you know what 
for the sake of keeping a low profile and showing these guys that I also have muscles for the very first time, <laughs> I feel I have not exercised for such, such a long time. If we can get to 10 health before escaping, that would be amazing. Because we're gonna face the harsh times of the sea. I need some more strength to push up the ropes, to manage the sails, and to scream to my sailor man, which is gonna be myself. You know, I envisioned this as that part of the Pirates of the Caribbean franchise, that movie where Jack Sparrow is that in that crazy world. I think it's the Davis Locker when he gets killed by Kraken. And he's out there in that very white world with that ship. I think it was Black Pearl. Yeah, it was the Black Pearl. And he's commanding himself and so many clones he has. I envisioned that after escaping on this prison layout. That's what I'm gonna be in the Reginald ship. I have not forget about that. We're gonna sail on the Reginald ship. And that's who I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be myself and 20 clones, and I'm gonna order them what to do. Sparrow, man the sails. Sparrow, all hands on deck. Sparrow 1, Sparrow 2, Sparrow 3, all hands on deck. I need all of you up there because we're boarding another ship and we're gonna have a fight in front of us. Arr! Let's take a shower, get all the salt out of me because we are gonna face some more salty waters in the future. We are very close to get to nighttime. It's a good thing, actually. I think it's the very first time. I think it is a good thing having such a short day. Because what I want to do must be done during the night. So let's do that. I hope I don't get another cell check down. That will be the second in just one day. That is not fair, is it? No, it's not. And I am not getting it. Good. So, ladies and gentlemen, Dr. F, Nupila Lapin, Katmeister, Assassins, MC, The Paragader, The Cookie, Lucas Wilson, Thundercrack, Unforgiving Czar, Israel Okoa, Flipsy, Don Sparse, Stephanie Few, and Sir Oi Inch. Goodbye, everyone. This might be the time where you can say you almost captured the Sparrow's journey. Every time I say that, there's at least two or three more episodes in which I say that. Because the one I first started saying it is not the one I escape. But oh well, we're still doing my research on the roof. So let's keep it at that. Let's see what we need to bring up the roof. I have so many cups of molten chocolate that I have not used. But let's not be hasty. I might still use them on guards to find out who has a certain key. I am not totally convinced that we don't need to use the generator. We probably do. So let's bring this with me. Okay, this is all I need to bring with me right now. And let's go up into the ventilating system. Like so, like so, like so. I don't believe that the fake vent cover hasn't broke yet. Seriously. On that episode that I had to load back, the thing broke so easily, so soon. Okay, I'm gonna leave this cutting floss over here. The fake vent cover. One more fake vent cover. The toothpaste, and let's bring the plastic staff key, because who knows, I might need to come in the prison again. Let's switch outfits, like so. Let's leave this one over here. I could bring the trowel, but one trowel is not enough to make a good hole. If you know what I mean. My ship, Reginald, is up in the roof, so I think we're good to go. Let's do that. This staff key is still at 90%, that's more than enough to go through oh my god it's still it's still it's still daytime it's still 9 p.m sparrow wait for the night to come that was so lucky i am so glad that they didn't detect that hole in the fence that i made last night now i'm gonna have to dodge the lights and other than that i should be all fine so 10 p.m is that enough nighttime no, it's not. I guess we have to wait for 11 p.m. Let's check the office room. The employment office. So, the vent cover is still there, right? Yes, everything's cool. Everything's good. You know what I should do? 
I have a fake vent replacement cover near that hole. I should probably bring another one down there in case some crap happens and I need to replace it immediately. Because if that happens, you know, there's patrols around the employment office and they might detect the hole once it's there. You know, I have this one. I have that one, Sparrow. You're so careful sometimes. And sometimes you're so reckless. I'm either 8 or 80, if you know what I mean. Okay, here we are. Let's do this. I'm gonna bring the makeshift raft. Who knows? Who knows? I might escape. Who knows? Oh my god, I need a sheet rope. Effort. I needed a sheet rope. God freaking damn it. And I don't think you can use the grappling hook in the ways you could use a sheet rope, can you? No, you cannot, because you can only ascend with a grappling hook. What a goddamn bad idea. So I'm gonna have to wait one more full day to get on that side. You know what? I'm gonna test this out. I am not sure if you can use the grappling hook to get over here. So I'm gonna try that out. If that doesn't work, it's fine. You can always get in the prison again. This is still not working, right? Why would it be any different right now? Sometimes I'm an idiot. Let's get down here. There we go. And let's try to use the grappling hook. Oh my god, you can't even see the roof from here. So obviously, that hole there in the wall is to come down here, not really to go up. So, this night proved to be very, very useless. You know, we have the grappling hook. I don't think you can get over the belayer walls, can you? Let's try this out. Check Nasty, did you, did you really need to be there? Let's see, you cannot do this, can you? No. This can only be used on rooftops. Wow, that's something I've never seen myself. You know, I could do as easy as just getting myself busted. Oh my god, did I just... I did not want to do this! But wait, this might actually be good. It was good if there wasn't a fence here. Dude, there's nothing over here. Why would I want to bring this fence down? But you know what? These sturdy curvers, covers, cutters are really good. So let's just let's just use them. They're not gonna break anytime soon. So let's just do this. Two more clicks, and we should be go good to go. There might have been a prisoner stash over here. Oh wait a second. Can I? No! No! Dude, I didn't. I didn't even use the. The zipline, the zipline hook. Oh my god. Okay. Makeshift raft? I can't use it. Okay. Someone said in the comment section that I need to use it on one place specifically. Oh my god. I never envisioned this episode as the one I was gonna escape. Oh my god. Are you serious? Are you serious? Where do I need to use it? Dude, 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 the person that said it to me said there is some sort of docks. If you keep going around the prison, you will find it out. Oh my god, dude, this is a dead end. Oh my god, 4 a.m. <laughs> I must go around, maybe it's at the bottom, at the south part. Oh my god, Chen Connery, do your stuff, dude. We, we, oh my god, I never envisioned this as being the episode I would escape. Seriously? That was so random. I even thought I could have not do anything on this episode on this night because I was missing sheet rope. Where is the freaking dog? There must be something looking different. <gasps> is this it? Ploof? Ploof? Mom! I have escaped, Mom! Shush! 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 I'm almost there! Mom! Where is my cake? This will be nominated, officially, as the most surprising prison layout 
ever. And at the same time, even though I've already said this in the previous episode, this is definitely the most lucky prison layout I've ever had in my entire YouTube series on the escapists. Honestly, I never, never even imagined that I could escape tonight. I didn't even use the zipline hook, man, and I really wanted to use that. I might even go back on myself just to use that zipline hook. I will get to the docks again with my Reginald chip, and I will go up there just to use the zipline hook. You escaped HMP Iron Gate. Player stats 110. Player reputation, 1,194. Wow, they have a lot of stats now. Good behavior, 1,379. I'm bad with math and English all mixed up. Bad behavior, that is taking a lot of score from me. Days taken bonus, zero. I'm not here to escape ASAP. Screw you, I'm here to escape for fun. Again, if there was a line saying, Having fun while escaping. My score will be infinite. Not even over 9,000. Just infinite. No number could count it. Overall score, 3,171. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys have all enjoyed this prison layout. I guess we're gonna move on to the next one. I am really, really sad that we didn't use the zipline hook. <laughs> I really wanted to experience that. Because apparently it's one-time thing, it's a unique thing, together just tied with this prison layout. I don't think you can do it in any other prison layout. But in the future, who knows, with a prisoner editor custom layout that people can make prisons with, and other new official prisons, who knows, we might use that in the future. So, I hope you all enjoyed this. My name is Sparrow Jenny. please like, comment and subscribe. I'm gonna meet my mom now, have that cake, eat it and embrace it while we sail to another prison, commit more crimes, plunder more ships, and be arrested again into the gallows. Bye-bye, everyone. Arr! Thank you for watching, everyone. If you are looking for more, feel free to check these suggestions. As a reminder, if you're looking into buying games, considering using my G2A ref link in the description of this video. Ladies and gentlemen, I'll see you on the next one. And remember, stay above the waters.